In this video, the TM1638 module will be programmed using Arduino Uno. The module has TM1638 IC, driving 8 digit 7 segment display, in addition to 8 LEDs and 8 push buttons. The TM1638 module is shown here. The heart of the module is the TM1638 IC, which is a uh, LED driver. And also we have on the module 8 digit to 7 segment display and also we have 8 LEDs and 8 uh, push buttons here. The pinouts of the module we have here VCC, ground, strobe, clock and uh, data I.O. And the module is programmed using the Arduino which is interfaced uh, with the module using serial connection so the strobe pin clock and uh, data IO are all connected to digital pins of the Arduino. The heart of this module is the ICTM1638 which is a fully programmable LED driver. A microcontroller initiates communication with this IC by first sending a low pulse to the strobe pin and then the clock and the data are sent through pins clock and DIO and the communication is terminated by sending a high pulse to the strobe pin. The TM1638 can be programmed with four commands activate board command, single address mode, address auto increment mode, read buttons mode. The first command we have to send to the TM1638 is the activate board command which has a hexy value of 8 and then the second digit is between 0 and F. The second digit determines the brightness of the display. The single address mode command which has a hexy value of 44 allows us to send a byte to one of the LEDs or one of the seven segment displays. After sending the single address uh, command byte, the next uh, byte we send uh, determines the address of the device we want to communicate with, either the eight LEDs or the eight uh, seven segment displays. And this uh, eight bit address must always start with uh, hexy value C and then a four bit value. And then once the address has been sent, the next piece of byte we send is the data itself to that uh, device. To send multiple data to multiple devices, we need to send this command byte, which is the address auto increment mode. And the command byte has a value of 40. After sending this byte, we then send the address of the first device and then send its data. And the next data we send will go automatically to the next device because the address is automatically incremented and so on. This feature is useful in resetting the LEDs and the seven segment displays before we start sending any data to these devices. Finally, we have the read buttons command and the command byte is 42. So by sending this byte, it means that we want to read from the eight onboard uh, push buttons on the module. Now this part will not be covered in this video, it will be covered in future videos. The device addresses for the TM1638 module is shown here. For the LEDs we have LED1 has address uh, C1, LED2 C3, until LED8 which has address CF. And for the seven segment uh, displays, uh, the address is C0 up to CE. Now let's start programming the TM1638 module. We start with this simple program that will toggle the LEDs on the board. The strobe and the clock and the uh, data IO are all connected to pins 8, 9 and 10 respectively. And the pins are set as output. Here we've included a header file tm1638 underscore initialization, which is this uh, function here. So the purpose of this function is to initialize the chip by first activating the chip and setting the brightness to, let's say, maximum. 
and to do this so the first thing we need to do is to send a low pulse through the strobe pin and then uh, using the shift out statement we send the byte 8F uh, which will uh, activate the chip and also set the brightness to maximum and then we send a high pulse uh, through the strobe pin after activating the TM1638 we need to send uh, the auto increment uh, mode uh, command which will reset the LEDs and the uh, seven segment displays and to do this first we need to send the uh, low pulse to the strobe pin and then using the shift out we send the command byte uh, 40 which uh, invokes the auto increment uh, mode and then we send the high pulse uh, to the strobe pin. Now to reset the LEDs and the seven segment displays we need to execute uh, this uh, part of the code. So first we need to uh, send the low pulse to the strobe pin and then using shift out we will send this uh, byte C0 which is the address of the first uh, device on the module C0 and the address is as mentioned before is from C0 to CF we have 16 devices 8 LEDs and 8 7 segment displays and then using this for loop we will shift out uh, the data 0 to uh, the devices so starting from address C0 up to address CF they will have uh, 0 sent to them and then once this is done we will send the high pulse uh, to the strobe pin. After resetting the display on the module we want to send the single address mode uh, command uh, in order for us to send data to the LEDs and the seven segment displays. So first we need to send the low uh, strobe pulse and then send the using the shift out the the command byte for the single address mode and then send the high pulse uh, strobe. After we initialize the TM1638 within the loop function we want to toggle the first LED which has an address of C1. So first we need to turn on the LED by sending the low strobe then we shift out the address C1 then we shift out the value 1 to turn on the LED and then we send the uh, high strobe and the same thing for uh, switching off the LED we just need to send 0 and now we toggle the last LED which has address of CF in this next example we want to send some data to the seven segment displays First we need to initialize the TM1638 and then within the loop function we want to send the message hello to the display. First we need to send the letter H. First we need to shift out the address of the first display which is C0. Then we need to shift out the value hexy value 76 which will draw the letter H on the first display. We do the same for the other letters. Finally, this code will uh, send data to all of the seven segment displays and also turn on all of the LEDs. A link to the code will be provided in the description. In a future video, I will program the TM1638 to respond to any key press on the module in order to display some information on the seven segment displays. Thank you for watching.